what is going on guys so i want to make a real quick video on about how i grew enough courage to go bald i shaved my head i shaved my hair for a good reason my hairline was terrible it was running away from my face my hairline looked like a good stock like that thing was crooked and it was running up that way like it was all the way down here on this side and all the way up here on this side it was a hot mess um and all this happened at the tender age of 19 years old I was going into the barber shop, man, and like one day he cut my stuff in the corners and it just did not come back the next time I came back for a cut. It just never grew back. They started using paint, you know, on my hairline. I'm taking a shower. The ink's going down my leg. It's going down the drain, man. Worst experience ever. So demoralizing. Um, I had a friend named Phil and he had went as Vin Diesel to a Halloween party I had went to. And he had actually stuck with the look after the Halloween party and it looked great because um, he was in a similar situation that I was in, except he had, you know, kind of like a backwards widow's or he kind of had like a widow's peak or whatever. And, you know, it wasn't as bad as mine. He wasn't inking his stuff because he could like, you know, swoosh it over and do all kinds of other stuff because he was Italian. But, you know, it looked great. Once I got done, um, you know, shaving my head, I was hanging around with my friends and people were like, wow, you should have been do did that, man. W what took you so long? Um, and then I realized that, like, you know, being bald really isn't that bad. Um, in our society, a lot of people think that um, women don't like bald guys or like being bald is not cool or it's like, you know, you automatically look like an old man. And it's just not the case. Um, like, sure, if you're out of shape and you're bald, it looks a lot worse if you uh, have a full head of hair and you're bald. But either way, if you're not well put together, you're not well put together. Um, you being bald or having hair really isn't going to change that. Um, and besides me getting like a cool set of frames and like, you know, some drip, like this cool Dragon Ball t-shirt, <laughs> me going bald was one of the best things that ever happened to me. Um, don't be afraid, you know, we're that with confidence, you know, and I, I got an egg head, I got a noggin, okay? I, I do, you know, my head is not circular like whatsoever. And if it don't look too bad on me, there is hope for everyone else on this planet. Um, and a lot of people, you know, are getting like hair transplants that are expensive. They look crazy. Beard transplants that look crazy. Guys, my, I, as you can see, like my beard don't connect either. I need to shave. Um, but it looks good. It's not too bad. Um, besides me having to shave every once in a while, you know, when they get five o'clock shadow, I'm loving it. Um, I save a whole bunch of money on haircuts, you know. Um, you know, I stay cool in the summer, you know, and I'm not worried about, you know, if my barber is going to be tied up or not. Anybody that is black that ever went to a black barber shop knows they have the worst customer service ever. I no longer have to deal with that waiting an hour, hour and a half for a haircut. Those days are behind me. Um, you know, shave it, you know. Um, you will be shocked at what you look like once you are all cleaned up, I hope you guys have a good day. Um, you know, if you if you know that you're bald and you're losing your hair, bro, just make the leap. I promise you it's the best decision ever. You guys have a good day. I'm out.